What is up ladies and gentlemen, it's Scott here from Fudge Muppet with a brand new Is It Worth It video today regarding the Gatling Laser. Now the Gatling Laser, you may know it as the biggest, most badass gun for a heavy weapons character. And we did use it recently in our scientist build, so you should go check that out. It's essentially a laser minigun. It does really nice damage and it runs off fusion cores, but is it worth it? Now, my two biggest points against it are A, it runs off fusion cores, which could be used for your power armor, and B, it's simply not efficient. You can run through 500 shots in no time. But I will say, if you do get the charged capacitor mod, it all of a sudden becomes very efficient. You do much higher damage per shot, but it fires much slower, so it doesn't have that real cooled sound. Apparently, also, Nuclear Physicist works well with it, because what happens is, if you actually use a fusion core, use all 500 shots, Shots. It still appears as 500 shots, but when you take the fusion core out to reload, instead of being a empty fusion core, you'll actually sort of have a half empty fusion core sitting in your inventory, so it'll actually cycle through the rest of the 100% ones and just make all your 100% fusion cores, you know, half capacity. But still, the nuclear physicist perk does give you the double length for Gatling lasers as well, but it doesn't just show you numerically like it doesn't turn 500 shots into a thousand. Now, reasons it's worth it. Obviously, it's worth it. The scientist build. We just made the entire scientist build whose end game weapon is the Gatling laser. But once again, I say Gatling laser end game. It's like if you have nuclear physicist or you had just have heaps of fusion cores, it works really well. And of course, it's only really worth it if you are a heavy weapons character. And it's absolutely awesome. But if you really want to get the most out of it, definitely use the charge capacitor. I found a lot of the time that sometimes you can just simply kill enemies quicker with a plasma sniper. So I would say that the Gatling laser is maybe a bit more situational. Maybe you should fight you know, big enemies with it or when you're fighting larger groups that you can all mow down repetitively and you can just keep it going and keep it cycling. Which reminds me, there's just a little tip I want to share with you guys first. If you use the charged capacitor mod and you hold down the trigger and it's just slowly pulling off its shots going one, two, three, four, or whatever speed it is, if you actually let go of the trigger and press again really quick before it stops the firing cycle, you will actually double down and make it fire even faster. So you can sort of counter that uh, disadvantage by making it slower. You could also use the special Gatling Laser Final Judgment, which actually increases the firing speed as well. So overall, I think the Gatling Laser is, of course, a fantastic weapon. It's just a matter of whether you have enough money or just fusion cores in general to support it. And if you don't have the charged capacitor mod, it is so easy to just run through the whole thing. Like, trust me, going trigger happy, just running through spraying raiders down. You can run out of that 500 ammo quick smart and having to be replacing a fusion core again. So sometimes I think it's just not the most efficient thing, though, combined with a nuclear physicist perk and the charged capacitor, you can really get the most out of the gun. And of course, damage wise, it's fantastic. There's no qualms or problems there. It basically just comes down to an efficiency problem. Is it worth fusion cores? I would say personally, if you have a power armor character like the scientist, I ended up with like 40 fusion cores and I'd barely run out of them because my power armor wouldn't really use them up because it's effectively 80 fusion cores for a normal person without nuclear physicist. So using the Gatling laser with that was perfectly fine because I had shit tons of fusion cores anyway. Or even my original character that I very first played had high charisma and high intelligence use power armor. Gatling laser is perfect. The only thing I didn't have was the heavy weapons perk. So overall, if you're going for the scientist build or you're going for some just heavy guns kind of guy, it's definitely worth it. Do make sure you can afford the fusion cores. And if you are worried about efficiency, definitely use the charged barrel thing. It does more damage than the normal shot, but it is the slower firing thing. You don't get that satisfying kind of thing. So that's all from me. That's my thoughts on the Gatling laser. I think it's worth it if you can deal with the efficiency problem and you can sort of work it out yourself. But it is definitely an awesome weapon. So I'm Scott from Fudge Muppet. I'll see you later and subscribe for more Fallout 4 builds, videos, and is it worth it videos.